What's up guys, in today's video, man, we are going over my squirrel tanning, okay? A squirrel that I have tanned out, okay? Less than 24 hours. She's been sitting out here less than 24 hours. I mean, she's just been out here baking in the sun, dude. Got some salt on them. Now I got the salt on there and I'm leaving out in the sun just to dry, dry itself out for the, like, for the next 24 or so hours. It, it looks really nice. It's one of, the, one of the best squirrel skins I've ever done. So I'm really excited to see how this turns out. I'll drop a comment, let me know if I'm doing something wrong. I've rarely, I've barely ever done this tan skin. Um, I've scanned animals before, but you know, just to dress, field dress them, right? I never really tanned. So if y'all got any tips, pointers, let me know, dude. Drop a comment. But yeah, man, let's let's just talk about how we did this, right? So right where I'm sitting, right here, uh, I was doing this last night. But as y'all can tell, right here, man, all last night, I got all the meat off of her, all the meat I could. Granted, I don't have most of the tools, you know, that the professionals use but uh i do need to probably order one on amazon so y'all help me out smash that like button so i was just sitting there scraping all that stuff off i got the thumbtack started getting her real tight stretched out this is what she feels like after you know sitting out overnight kind of all day today it's currently now like two o'clock so kind of half of the day already i was out here for probably about four hours doing this right my old lady was asleep I was just out here working doing this. I do believe I need some like tanning solution, right? For, and I just like brush it on there. I don't know, to make it brown. That's what I'm thinking it does. You could just naturally do it. I've naturally done it before. Granted, I don't think it turns out as good, but you know what? Use what you got, you know what I mean? But anyway, guys, we got a nice, beautiful squirrel right here on a board just pinned up. Leaving her out in the sun, man. So without further ado, I'll let y'all know uh, how she turns out in a little bit. When I unpin it, take all the salt off. Like, I'll update y'all when stuff happens and when I, you know, mess with it a little bit. We're going to make this the best looking squirrel skin I have, like, ever had. But anyway, y'all go check out America Fetcher at AmericaFetcher.com. Link and promo code will be in the description below. I'll update y'all when something happens, right? All right, guys, so it's been about a week. This is kind of like our little, we're on the way to our final product. We're really close. I need to find a really good tanning solution so we can put it on this jack. It is looking nice, bro. It is looking real good. Tail's nice and firm right here, dude. Just look how smooth. Dude, it's literally just like leather, man. I got all the meat off, all the fat I possibly could, man. I mean, this is a, this looks just beautiful, dude. Other than that, dude, I mean, I really want to take these thumbtacks off and see what the fur looks like. See, see, see what the hide looks like underneath. Cause I have yet to take it apart. It got wet one time. I had to throw it up against a heater real quick just to dry it out. A uh, little silly mistake, but uh, let's get these thumbtacks off and look at them. Man. All right, y'all. Just one by one, we're gonna take each thumbtack out. All right, last one, baby, right there. Dude, let's freaking look at them. Y'all get first look, dude. They look good. They look good. What y'all think, man? How's that look, dude? Oh my goodness, man. That is pretty. Granted, you can see some of the BB holes that I put in. There's one right right here. There's a there's another one right here. You find where the BBs hit this squirrel. Turn around on the back side, you see one. Uh two three four five six seven you see seven holes in this thing the shotgun did some damage man i'm gonna slowly move to my left see if i see him i knew he'd come out eventually there he is that's what i'm freaking talking about baby <laughs> folded folded got his eyes <laughs> We got number uno, baby. All right. But dude, it... It smells like any other hide you would get when you buy it, right? We're gonna send old Betsy to the side. I believe that was her name. I could be wrong. I forgot already. We got Big Bertha, bro. This is Big Bertha. She's a big one. She's a big one. But man, once you get done with it, the final product is just amazing, man. Once you can staple that, you could literally just staple the tail when you get done with it. Uh, just put it like right here, somewhat hidden a little bit. You know, 
staple the tail together, sew the tail, whatever you want to do. But this ain't over yet. Y'all stay tuned, and uh, I hope I hope we're gonna enjoy the final product, man. They, I hope it does look really freaking good. All right, shoot now. All right, guys. So, so I got the final product right here. The squirrel is looking phenomenal. It's been about a month, give or take. This process would take about a week really it really doesn't take long maybe even three days if that uh so y'all this is what we got man it's freaking beautiful man freaking beautiful hide beautiful first intact really good the tail's actually in my truck i should have i should have got it before i started this video y'all can tell you know it's looking really freaking good man now what i did on the hide side i kind of egg washed it as you can tell right here honest honestly bro you would just whisk your egg up put it all up on this hide part on your hide part make sure not to get on the fur and man i mean let it let it sit out you got it man so y'all i mean this is what you're really looking for man it's really what what you're looking for no leftover meat on it no it smells just like it smells just like what you would buy from the store really man it's freaking soft what i did not show you guys is after you get semi this really finished before you actually tan it you would clean it right so what i did i kind of tanned it a little bit and then i cleaned it it's better off for you to clean it before you start tanning it but anyway guys she, here she blows man nothing too special i really want to get some more squirrel season's not over yet so we gonna get some more but anyway guys this is the final product oh, she turned out freaking wonderful beautiful beautiful y'all leave a like on this video make sure you subscribe if you're new i'll see you on the next video baby